it's, it's you, you can working memory short lived. It's only as long as you're able to rehearse it, and then it disappears. Whereas what we call long term memory, if I it, remembering what you had for breakfast or your vacation, this is information that gets consolidated and, and gets put into a a more durable form that we call long-term memory. And the interesting thing about memory is that these are separate systems. Everything from working memory just doesn't pass into long-term memory. They're, they're two completely different systems and, and two completely different parts of the brain that seem to control it. Um, so working memory, uh, the frontal cortex seems to be very important for working memory. When, when we are holding information in line, the neurons, the brain cells in the frontal lobes are active and they stay kind of active as long as we're holding on that information. And they're more active when the information is relevant. Um, and if we, uh, we, we get distracted, they'll get less active. 